I've came here to St. Mary's Well and this is a very interesting looking place. I don't know whether these be graves or what. Oh, they come, oh, are they stations of the cross with numbers on them? Ah. Looks like some birds came to a very untimely end here. I think Mr. Fox has been around here. Uh, so the well itself is this spring here. Oh, oh people are leaving things, look. This is fascinating. If I'd known about this, now I could have brought something. Um, what do I have that I could leave? Um, I don't have nothing. I have nothing in my pockets. Okay. Um, I'm not going to talk about why people leave things. They do. So, this here is the well. It's the seven stations. So, there are stations here. If you look in here, you'll see a lot of things have been left by people. see all the stuff and the description is this chapel was built in honor of the Blessed Virgin in the year of our Lord 1798 interesting by John Linnet of Rossack that's Latin beats me now the water in this well there are a lot of these wells all over Ireland and um, they have um, properties, curative, curative properties. Oh, look, wow. I feel like I should leave something here, but I've absolutely got nothing with me because I'm cycling, you see. Inside is this beautiful more more um, holy statues. So back to the water, um, a lot of these wells in Ireland have like curative properties and the specific property of this well is uh, meant to be eyes, it's um, good for the eyes, but I'm going to take that a stage further and say that it's possibly, uh, on the, never mind the physical, on the metaphysical, it helps one to see things clearly. Um, so I'm going to take a drink anyway and see what goes on here. nice water. Sweetish, not exactly sweet, but nice. Here's something I could leave. It's the, it's the key from my old apartment that I don't need anymore. So I'm going to leave that. Okay. <laughs>